here we have to calculate maximum height right so here we all we know one basic concept what is that if a particle reaches maximum height at those points velocity is zero if particle reaches maximum point at those point velocity is zero here the velocity you can take in the direction of y axis therefore you can write it as v1 now we have to calculate h what is h that is nothing but the particle the travel along y axis right that is displacement of the particle along y axis that is nothing but sy sy gives h here right so we have one basic formula what is that v square is equal to u square plus 2 as right here all our formula concept based on y axis therefore you can write this formula as v y square is equal to u y square plus 2 a y and s y so because projectile motion is uh, it's a two dimensional you can take x as well as y here concept depends on y axis that's why we are taking uh, with respect to y axis clear now substitute all those points here so this value is zero so earlierly we discussed u y value as u sin alpha here it is u sin alpha whole square plus 2 ay what is ay minus z and sy is nothing but capital h therefore here you can write 2 gh is equal to u square sin square alpha by using this what is h u square sin square alpha by 2g right therefore the maximum height of the particle in the projectile motion gives h is equal to u square sin square alpha by 2g so in this session we discuss capital t and r and h formula these three are very very useful formula in solving projectile motion based questions right students please subscribe my max guru channel here you can find max as well as physics video lessons which are useful for both iit je as well as neat thank you very much